While working on his masterpiece, Ulysses, the novelist James Joyce ran into a friend who asked him how the writing was going. Joyce responded that he had been working all day and produced only two sentences. His friend asked, You've been seeking the right words? No, said Joyce. I have the words already. What I'm seeking is the perfect order of the words and the sentences I have. It took James Joyce seven years to write his novel. Now, you probably don't want to spend that kind of time working on the typical reports, proposals, and emails that you write. Yet, I've never met a business writer who intended to be wordy. The problem comes in seeing what to leave out. Consider these four tips to help you cut the clutter. First, don't write too soon. Just as in a sprint or a marathon, it doesn't matter how slowly you start, what counts is your finishing time. Some people dash off an email or report as if they, are, they have no strategy at all. They write at full speed, keying in whatever thoughts come to their mind, and then they organize and they rearrange on the fly. By the time they get to the end of that document, they've collected quite a few details in their path as they cut through to the conclusion. Now, the, the real problem is that the reader has to follow that same clutter to arrive at that conclusion. Often, you can bypass much of the clutter if you take your time at the start to think about where you want to end that race. What's the key message that you want to get across? What's the shortest path to get there? What detail is essential to arrive at that destination? What detail would actually be irrelevant and distracting if included? 